What's going on guys? One thing I'm going to talk about today, or what this video is about, <coughs> is improving your accuracy. Um, if you do this, I almost guarantee that it's going to help you uh, get tighter groups and uh, even shoot further or longer and hold your bow for a longer period of time. Um, what it is, <coughs> it actually goes over uh, target panic and how to hold your bow for a longer period of time. So what I do is I come out and uh, I shoot for my session however long that is. Let's just say I shoot for an hour. And at the end of that hour that I'm done shooting, I'm not going to shoot any more arrows for the day, I will start at my furthest distance. For me, that's 90 yards. I'll go walk out to 90. I'll draw my bow back. I'll get on target and I'll hold my pin for as long as I can hold it on, on target. And as soon as I start wobbling and, and getting off target, I'm going to move up to 80. I'm going to draw my bow back, and I'm going to do it again. I'm not shooting my bow. I'm simply drawing my bow back with an arrow in it, holding my form as, for as long as I can without shooting an arrow. And, and as soon as I move off of my target, I let down and I walk up. And I do that all the way up to 20 yards. What this is going to do is it's going gonna, it's gonna to train your muscles. The whole, you're going to really be stressing your muscles, especially if you shoot, you know, for an hour straight and then you go out and you do this, this drill, you're going to, by the time you get to 20 yards, man, you're going to be all over the target. And that's good. And continue to do this when, as you progress, you know, the, the third week or the fourth week, you're going to, you're going to start noticing, man, I've been able to hold this a lot longer on target. And then you're also going to notice that by strengthening your muscles up, you're going to hold that pin a lot steadier on your target during your shooting session. So give that a try. Um, I, I'm 99% sure it's going to help you guys out if you follow that. Uh, the target panic is one thing I, I need to go back over is don't shoot that arrow because you're going you're gonna to draw back and you're going to want to shoot it, but don't shoot that arrow subconsciously you when that pin gets on that target you want to you want to shoot so you're gonna you're 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 dealing with two different things you're dealing with your back muscles and holding your bow and your mind and not shooting that arrow and controlling your your pin, target panic so try that out i'm telling you it's going to work for you um if you guys have any more questions or any want any more tips on how to shoot your bow a little bit better, go ahead and leave comments below and uh, I'll get back to you.